Welcome to editing. Now that you have made everything better, it's time to make it correct. First thing to look at is capitalization. There's an address below. Go to that and watch the video. Then go back and correct your writing piece using those rules. Take notes on the capitalization rules as you watch the video. Please take note at the bottom regarding the video. Spelling is the next thing. Here's a video on spelling that has some spelling rules that will help you check your spelling. Can't always depend on spell check. It catches a lot of them, but it doesn't catch all of them. There's another fun place to go, another link to a video for more spelling fun and more tips. There are a lot of rules of punctuation. We're just going to look at a few basic ones in this lesson. Ending punctuation. Check to see that each one has ending punctuation. Exclamation points, question marks, are they in the right place? Commas. There's a link to a video for comma rules. In your grammar notes, you need to write down these comma, comma rules. They are the most common comma rules. It is not all of them, but it will give you a good start on using your commas. It also includes using them with compound sentences and coordinating conjunctions, which we'll look at more a little later in the video. Sentence structure. Look at your writing piece. Review it. Is there a subject and a predicate, or do you have fragments? Check for fragments. Make sure each of your simple sentences, otherwise known as an independent clause, is complete with its necessary parts. Remember what a subject is and a predicate is. Sentence structure in regards to compound sentences. Check with the, your writing with the bullets below. If you're not sure what that means, continue on in the video and you'll have more information regarding the compound sentence structure. Remember the fanboys? For and nor, but, or, yet, so. Coordinating conjunctions. Examples are below for you to review. Check against your writing piece. Check your own. Also a sentence structure is complex sentences. Do they have one dependent and one independent clause? Be careful, they're punctuated differently. A complex sentence is made up of one independent, one dependent. It can be ICDC or DC comma IC. Take a look at the examples below for appropriate structure and punctuation. Final review, once you've gone through and done these editing steps, you need to check against the rubric for any further details, such as figurative language being in the appropriate place and all the other things on your rubric. Thank you and congratulations on completing your editing. You're now ready to make the corrections on the Word document.